Oh, well, well, eh? What about that? I never ever thought I'd hear myself saying that. You're looking at a rich man, so you are. Well, you don't look any different to me. You remember I went to see the bank manager about raising some money on this place to buy the garage? Yeah. Mm. Not only has he said yes, but he's put it in my bank account already, so he has. So if you add that to the ten grad from Uncle John, I reckon I'm worth £35,000. That's great, Jim. No, oh, it is. Yeah, question is, what in the name of God do I do with it now? I mean, I can hardly go around Kev, can I? Say, right, Kevin. Let's get this garage business signed, sealed and delivered. I mean, not with what he's going through, can I? No. Well, don't do anything for now. Just, you know, leave it. Ah, oh, poor wee man. Perhaps I should go and see him. You know, see how he's doing. Yeah, come up. Sally. Right. Oh. Listen, I don't want you worrying about the garage business, all right, you know? We'll talk about that when you're good and ready. I don't know when that's going to be. Well, I told you, don't worry your head. We in Tyrone, we'll keep things ticking over, so we will. Hey, Jim. Hey, Sally. Shall I put this away? Uh, yeah, please, and let me know what I owe you. No, it's OK. Oh, I meant to tell you as well, the, uh, the funeral's on Monday at one o'clock. One o'clock, right. I'll be there, so to own. How is Tyrone? Cos... Cos he saw it all, did he? Well, I'll tell you the truth, he's a wee bit quiet, you know, but... Well... Maybe the funeral will do him good, eh? I mean, they say funeral, but... It's not, is it? It's two. Alison and the baby. You burying them together? Yeah. It's what Alison wanted more than anything. A baby. Together, yeah? <laughs> 